Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mangus, and I welcome you to part two of this triple threat edition of Super Famicom <laughs> I said it, I knew I'd said it. Ah, oh, Super Famicom Wars, I mean Advanced Wars 2. Well, we're fighting Hachi, Nell, and Storm, all teaming up against me on this uh, reskinned version. It's actually not a reskin, it's... Or it is it? Actually, it is a reskin, because it's a copy, but it's in Advanced Wars 2, so... Anyway, it's a map from Super Famicom Wars. And we actually get superpower on Adder, which is not something you'll see me do a lot. Um, there is no point in using little power when you got superpower saved up, after all. The plus two movement is nice. It is actually very nice. It means that I can actually interrupt that harbor cap with my mech. Although I, I, I suspect there are some transports in the way, which would definitely be a shame. Let's see. No, good. No transports. That infantry must have come from somewhere else. Uh, and thanks to the plus two movement, I can do this, which is kind of great. I can finally shoot down that blasted fighter. And this sub is essentially dead, so I'm just going to do this. Um, yeah, this is a little bit bad, unless I can somehow do damage to the lander, which I can't, because I don't have any battlecopters nearby. But I can do this. Just gotta be really careful so I don't trap myself, so I don't want to move through the fog. That was a misclick, actually. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, but at least I brought his bomber down, which is great. Would love to destroy that rocket, but I also would love to capture the harbor. So, But I can do both, so it's really no problem. What I could do is I could move down here, but the cruiser would still be able to reach me. I am definitely going to have to ferry some more troops over here. I do would like to repair the sub, but I don't think I will. I'd much rather use it to scout out. Mm. Yeah, what should I do with this? Uh, like, uh, it was so fun to just kill the lander, but I will get wrecked by the cruiser on the next turn, so... I can't. I'm going to have to move away. All things considered, though, this is not going so bad. I thought it'd go much worse than this. But god damn it, Storm Infantry. God damn it. So fucking strong! Why are they so goddamn is goddamn strong? Um Alright, so I think what I wanna do right now is I wanna build a rocket right here. And a mech here to counter any vehicles that might come my way. Also do damage to the Storm Recon. That's that recon has been so valuable to Storm. Also, I want to protect my APC. I wouldn't want it to get sniped down. And that, that recon has definitely earned itself in. It has been extremely, extremely annoying. And of course, if Storm was a human player, that recon would have also given him a lot of vision. A, a human player would just hit that rocket in the forest, or that recon in the forest, and use it to scout out what I was building. That would definitely be the best way to use it. Ah, I don't like that cruiser. Oh, crap! No! Oh, no! I'm going to lose my sub. Oh, I'm gonna lose my sub. No. Oh crap, that is actually really, really bad. That is actually terrible. Uh. Ooh. Oh, fuck me. Hmm. Yeah, because. Ah, uh, thanks to that stupid cruiser. Oh no! <laughs> Oh god, this is bad. I didn't think it'd come this quickly. Ow! That really hurts. Did it damage the transport? Yes, it did. It damaged his own transport. It's surprising that thing didn't hit the uh, hit hit my rocket. You'd think it would hit the rocket. All it did really was damage a bunch of infantry. And of course, my sub died. That's a lot of value gone, actually. I needed that sub to take down landers. Missiles? Okay. Alright, at least I have some decent money right now. I actually think I'm going to combine these subs. Uh, yep, that's exactly what I'm going to do. If you combine the device... Uh, oh, actually! Ah! That's new. If you, uh, if you combine two subs and one of them is diving, then apparently you your sub um, resubmerges, which is interesting. I, I was not aware that happened. Alright, 
You learn something new every day, apparently. I need to block off this cruiser from my sub, although I think the Battlecopter might still attack it. Um, let's see, can I get rid of this infantry? I don't think I can. Oh my god, Sturm's defense. He has 150% fucking defense when uh, he uses the Bloody Meteor Strike. Also, there's a lander incoming pretty shortly. So, I think I need to build myself another sub. As much as I don't want to, I have to. Look at that defense. My god, his defense is absurd. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna move the rocket down here to the forest. Protect it. That tank I cannot do anything with. At all. I don't have any more money for infantry, so I might as well move them onto properties to heal them up. I don't really want to use this APC as a shield, but I think I have to do it. Things are looking a little bit bleak right now, actually. That, that meteor strike really fucked me over. Oh my god, now she's trying to capture my... Uh, now she's trying to capture my cities as well. Annoying little lady. Yeah, I lost a few too many subs, I feel. At least I get to shoot some down, so that's great. But I hope that Hachi doesn't have any means to actually kill my sub. That would make me really sad. I'm not sure how much damage Battlecopters do to subs, actually. I guess I'll never find out. But yeah, now you know that if you come... Oh my god, there's more of them. Of course, of course there was a cruiser there. I'm just playing poorly right now. I should have known there was a cruiser there and not play... Yeah, and play accordingly. Okay. What is Sturm going to do on his turn? He has that bloody cruiser that is just gonna fuck everything up for me. Um, the only thing I, the only real thing I can build to take that down would be a bomber. But even that, I don't think the bomber would one-shot the cruiser because Sturm has such good defense. Um, I need a battleship actually, but <laughs> there's no way I can afford a fucking battleship. At least my income is solid. They haven't really captured any of my properties yet, so I guess the game's still on. Yeah, um... Hmm. I guess I need Battlecopters. I think I definitely need Battlecopters. Let's see, can I take down the fighter? Yes, I can. That's pretty cool. I could attack the sub as well, but it would hit heal on its, uh... It would heal on its turn, so I guess it wouldn't really matter much. Uh, let's see, there's a cruiser there that I don't want to destroy my transport, so I'm going to move my battlecopter like this. Uh, there's some more transports coming. There's a lot of things happening at once here. We need to interrupt this cap. Shouldn't be too hard. There is a battlecopter that needs to be handled. Oh, I could have attacked with my rocket first. That was a little bit stupid of me. I should have done that. Hmm, it's going to be tricky getting this harbor. It's going to be very tricky. I need to use my infantry as good as possible to uh, to scout out what's going on. There's another lander incoming. Uh, what can I build right here that would be good uh, against all of these units? Or well, first of all, I need to address the situation right here. Oh, crap. I completely forgot about this. Um, I guess an artillery would actually be very useful. Maybe some artillery. Uh, but there are battlecopters right here. Um, I think a medium tank possibly would be pretty nice. I actually want to block the battlecopter in. There we go. Yeah, because of the cruisers, I can't really move my subs around as I want to. Unless I get a battleship. A battleship would really give me a lot of sound control, though. But fuck now for taking that city away from me. That is actually really bad for me. Yeah. That one cruiser Sturm built. Like, if I can just take that out. That's what I'm hoping with the artillery, at least. At least there's limited opportunities for Nell to actually unload. She has to... Oh, crap. She has to actually... Um, she has to actually unload mostly at my docks. Because there aren't that many shoals on the islands. Which makes it a little bit easier for me to defend, I suppose. Ba -ba 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 -ra -ba okay, that's the sub. I gotta remember the location of that. I could possibly take it down with my cruiser. I 
cruisers do one-shot subs, so that's good. I can scout the location out with my battlecopter and then kill it with my uh, cruiser. Okay, what is Sturm going to do? Bum 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 bum. Okay, bloody cruiser. Uh, I need to make sure my sub is not revealed. Hopefully that crucial will run out of fuel soon. I need to go back for refueling, and maybe it'll e maybe it'll even sink. That would be great. All right, my turn. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. So I can take or at least do some decent damage right here, and I think I'll definitely use my power. I'll need all the boost I can get right now on this turn. I gotta be careful not to lose my momentum because I'm I, I've noticed that I've stagnated a little bit, and they're starting to push me back. I need to make sure I stop them in their tracks right away and get as many cost-efficient trades as I possibly can. Alright, so first things first. We need to take back the city. We cannot allow now this income. It is too vital. Uh, sadly, we can't reach that. But anyway, we have to find the sub. There it is. Uh, in case of battleship, I'm going to place it right here. Oh, right, Hachi used his power, so he can't be killed this turn. Uh, I can definitely kill this lander. Mm. The problem with having a 7 hit point sub is that it can't one-shot lander, so it puts itself at risk of being killed by cruisers. But right now, it's the best I can do. There we go. Uh, I would prefer to actually try and capture this property instead of going after it. Alright, oh, I can kill this uh, tank with the rocket, or at least do significant damage to it, so that it's no longer really a, a, an issue. Mm, let's move the APC away and attack the Batacopter. So that Batacopter is essentially worthless right now. I can do some damage to the transport as well, to soften it up a little bit. And we have the medium tank here, which we built last turn. Wonderful. We've taken back some of the control. I would really, really enjoy a battleship right now. I really would. I'm going to place a... Maybe he'll move into the range of my artillery. I'll do this so the recon can't touch the... Um, touch the artillery. I gotta admit, I want another sub, but I, I can't... But this cruiser is locking down all of my sub... All of my subs at the moment. What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to build myself a bomber. It's very risky and it might not pay off, but there is a slight chance that the bomber might be effective against Cruiser Storm. Uh, Cruiser Storm, Cruiser St <laughs> Storm's Cruiser. God damn it. Okay, so she has a rocket on her island. It would appear that is shooting my my guys on my island. Ba 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 ba. And she has a lot of landers. God, she has so many landers. I can't, I, I'll, I'll imagine Hachi will need to have some battleships at some point, right? Okay, and there's the fighter. Like, seriously. He needs to have some battleships. He can build them for 14,000, for Christ's sake, when he uses his power. Ba 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 Alright, what can I do with that fighter? Can I reach it this turn? I sure as hell hope I can. Arr. I will never be able to cap that, will I? I don't think I will. Da 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 da. Ba da ba da ba 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 Time to retake this property. It was kind of stupid of me to let it get captured in the first place. But that's a blunder on my part. Nothing I can do about that right now. I'm gonna make up for it by keeping some units close right here. Okay. Um, I can certainly attack the cruiser, but there's a fighter here. Uh, and I can't... Hmm. I might attempt to lock the fighter in. Like so. That will at least reduce its... It will reduce its mobility a little bit, at least. Mm. I can kill the Battlecopter with my anti-air. There's also a Battlecopter over here, but it can't do much. 
I think I'm I'm pretty safe attacking here. There's no cruisers nearby. Mm. But I definitely want to bring the sub back here because um, there's a lot of shit going on right here. If I just had if, if cruisers were able to move on shoals, I could have shot down this fighter, that would be great, but now I need to protect my bomber as best as I can. So what's the range of the cruiser? What's the range of the bomber? If I move it over here, actually I can just use it to take down the recon. Why not? And I would have loved to build another sub, but I can't. Mm, would have been awesome to have some way of dealing with this. Actually, you know what I can do right now? I can build a fucking battleship. It will cost all of my money, but I think it's goddamn worth it. Yes, kill the transport. Wonderful. Sadly, no infantry available to reinforce right here. But it doesn't matter. Goddamn storm infantry! Arr! God, I hate storm infantry so much. Why is storm infantry so good? Okay, what can I do with this thing, really? Um, I don't know. I kind of want to move it away just in case he does have some sort of battleship nearby. Not sure if he does, but hey, at least I have a battleship right now. Now I just need to protect this battleship from Hachi subs, which I know are out there somewhere. But well, this battleship will be very useful. I gotta keep it alive. It's the only way to reliably kill enemy cruisers. Oh, well, that was a quick turn now. Ba 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 ba. God damn it! He is spamming air units. He really likes his air units a lot. And he just shielded his battlecopter. Wonderful. Hmm. And he unloaded something on my island. I just don't know what. I can build one infantry and, and scout it out though. So let's see what his assault actually <laughs> is compromised of. Now I hope Stern won't start loading off uh, heavier stuff on my island. I am definitely not liking the things he's unloading already. So more artillery. Still yet to see a medium tank or something heavy, but... I'm sure it will come soon. Alright, my turn again. So, uh, finally, I can do something about this. Uh, so I'm going to build one infantry right here to see... Okay, a recon. That is really no big deal. Okay, so... I am going to be killing this thing, that's for sure. I don't have the movement to reach this unless... Unless I do some damage first, which I might be able to do. Which I most likely will be able to do. Um, let's do some damage. Seriously, how have I not gotten power yet? Alright, so I need to... Do damage to the spider. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Now I should be able to shoot down the lander with my sub. Without having to waste my battleship's turn doing that. Of course, the uh, the lander has slightly increased defense from the uh, from the harbor, so I won't be able to one shot it. Oh, what? Oh, okay. Uh, well, that's useful actually to know. Well, at least that won't be able to do much more. Uh, we need to do damage to this mech because it's threatening our anti-air, and I don't like that. And of course, we're leaving this. Actually, ah, oh, one step too far away. The superpower, we could have killed that battlecopter, but no. Okay, I'm because of the power, I'm able to reinforce there, so I might get this harbor. That would certainly be great. I really want to keep my infantry alive. Um, do I want to build another sub? I think I want to build another sub. And I can place the artillery here as like anti-lander fodder. <laughs> that could work this infantry around. Maybe build myself an artillery. I have exactly enough money for that, so that could work. Alright, I have an anti air here, which I haven't used yet. I think I'm gonna use that to take down this. Use the lander to block shoals, maybe? That could work. Alright, that's all the units I can move this turn. I pray to god that Hachi doesn't have some sort of hidden fighter or cruiser to take down my bomber with, because that bomber is gonna be quite useful. Bum 
So what is Hachi going to do? I still haven't seen those battleships. I suspect he has them. Alright, I forgot about that recon. God, I hate Sturm's recons. Or is that Hachi's recon? I think it's Sturm, isn't it? No, I think it's Hachi's, actually. Sturm's recon would have been much more scary. Alright, so... I need to... Uh, I need to get control back of the seas. Now, the way to win this, I imagine, would be to constantly contest their landers, because the computer is wired to build landers when it has not. So, what happened to Nell very early on in this game, before Sturm came and busted her, uh, her out with a cruiser, was the fact that I kept shooting down her landers. She was forced to build new ones, and as a result, uh, she was completely handicapped, because landers are really expensive, and if you keep shooting them down, well, the results are going to be pretty good. So, oh right, he actually dealt damage to my sub. Uh, now I need to go and refuel it. Okay, uh, it has 14 fuel. Um, but I might be able to shoot it down. Yeah, that's fine. And we can do this with the bomber. Let's see, is, does he have a battleship? No, but he has a sub. I actually kind of like the fact that I scouted that. That makes things a little bit easier for me. Now what should we do with this rocket? Is there anything, any juicy targets we can fire on? Not that I can see. Just because I can't see them doesn't mean they're not there. As demonstrated right now. So I'm going to use my... It's a little bit scary to use my medium tank to target fire this missile. It's not like I really need to kill the missile anyway. I don't have any air units on the island, but... It's still a little bit useful to do so. I mean, in case I ever want to bring my bomber over, it's nice to get rid of the anti-air first. Alright, so... I am going to bring the sub over right now and, of course, submerge it. Is the APC dead? No, it's not. It's being used as a scout, so I need to get it over here so I can refuel my subs. Wouldn't like to build a new one unless I absolutely have to. I am actually going to build myself yet another sub. As I said, I think subs are the key to victory right here. Just because of sniping landers, it's so goddamn effective. Oh, I hope Nell can't attack this turn, or else I might be in trouble. <laughs> So Lady Luck gives Nell the potential to deal 10 hit points damage to units. I think it's 8 to 10. Uh, which means that she could literally one-shot any unit with any unit she has. Doesn't matter how weak her unit is. Doesn't, she doesn't give a fuck. She's lucky. And that is why she's overpowered. However, she's yet to really exploit her luck a lot. Oh, she's building so many landers! Oh my god, she's building so many landers. Alright, here comes the barter. No, actually, no. He is going for Merchant Union. Hello, Bomber. <laughs> Hachi has such a relaxed music compared to Sturm. Like, you got, you got, you like, and then you got the burp, 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 Sturm's part. Fits his nature, though. You gotta say. The more I listen to the Hachi theme, the more I like it. I, initially, I didn't like it at all. I thought it was terrible. I was like, this is not a CO theme. But then I was like, you know what? It fits in well. Crap. Meteor Strike time soon. God, I, I can't believe how quickly he's getting that power. I mean, considering I'm facing three COs and I'm, like, dividing my damage out over those units, I really think that Meteor Strike is coming more quickly than I thought. But I guess not. I mean, we're on day 21, so I suppose it's reasonable for him to get two meteor strikes off in a month. Alright. Well, time to pick off Landers. Thanks for sending me some damaged ones. I really appreciate that. Aw, oh, crap. I forgot she had power active, so... Well, do I want to use power? Probably, yeah. I think I'll go for power. So now with these three subs, I can absolutely handicap now. Maybe to the point where I can go and snipe her HQ? That would certainly be great. I don't think I can keep this going. Like these, the IS will just get stronger and stronger, and I don't think I can just win in a battle of brute force. So Sturm is gonna slowly, but no, oh, what the? F I thought for some weird fucking reason that I could attack the recon with the sub. Wow. Sometimes I question my abilities as a long Source player. I really do. All right, I'm gonna see if I can find the sub. Use quite a bit of fuel in doing so. 
gotta be careful, gotta watch the fuel level. 66 fuels remaining. This is this is cheating, but it's still part of the game mechanics, so I wouldn't call it cheating. I I wouldn't even call it exploiting. Okay, he had it there all along. Well that's that's something else entirely then. He just submerged it to Okay. Well, that's some useful intel. He just submerged it to uh, to avoid my uh, my recon or my cruiser from attacking it. Wow, he is really bringing a lot of units to my doorstep. Also a lander, that's useful to know. I'm gonna build another sub. I know I'm building a lot of subs, but I'm gonna build more. Okay, I don't want Meteor Strike to hit me on the next turn. I really don't, so I'm gonna constantly keep an eye on his power meter. Also, there is another Battlecopter incoming. How is his power meter doing? Oh, fuck me! Really? Oh, balls to the fucking walls. That is bad news. That is fucking bad news. I need more anti air. Mm. That's bad. That is really, really bad. Maybe I can clump up these units and make the meteor strike hit here. That would actually be kind of nice. I'm gonna keep these guys around in case now I'll get some funny ideas. Definitely don't like this new Battlecopter, it's probably gonna kill my rockets. Hmm. Yeah, that was, that was really disheartening. I'd hope to avoid the Meteor Strike for at least one more turn. But I underestimated the damage I needed to do to avoid doing that. Oh, here comes the Merchant Union, which is kind of crap, actually, in his current position. If he had any properties on the island, Merchant Union would have been fabulous, but I've yet to see the AI actually purchase units in cities. I don't actually think it's coded to do so. Because I played many matches against Hachi uh, when I first was a little bit curious about him, when I first unlocked him for the first time. I, said, I just said first like one million times in one sentence, but... Uh, and I noticed that the computer Hachi never built units in the cities during the superpower. I don't really know why, but I guess it values bases more than cities. Or maybe it's just not programmed to realize that the cities can function as bases. I don't really know why, I just lost something on the floor right there, and that's why you guys heard a bang. No, Sturm, don't crush me. Okay, where is it gonna head? I pray it's gonna hit my own harbor. That way, it won't at least weaken my position on the island. It hit- Aww, oh, my battleship! Sturm! What?! Kidding me? It hit one unit? Was that seriously the most I, I question that a lot. You gotta be fucking hit it. What the fuck? Did it just What? Did the meteor just hit a Okay. It might be that the meteor strike does not register register submerged units. Because it just hit one battleship. If it if it went like two tiles down, it would have also hit the bomber. Also, it could have hit here and done at least 40,000 cash worth of damage. So I actually question the meteor strike. In fact, it seems to me like the meteor strike is actually a little bit random right here. Because it could have gone one tile down and hit both the bomber, but it hit the battleship. Why did it only hit the battleship? Uh, why does Manx open up the menu when he doesn't need to? These are things I wonder about every day. All right, so, wow, that was it's the weirdest meteor strike I've seen. Maybe there's some hidden units around here. Maybe there's a sub right here or something that caused the meteor to not want to go down once, but I don't know. I guess we'll find out in the next part of Advanced Wars 2 Triple Edition. I hope you guys are enjoying this episode. If you do, give it a like. It really helps. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.